Hello there. As you take this test, Autoproctor will check that the test environment is safe and secure. Think of Autoproctor as a person who is watching you take the test, like a proctor or invigilator. Watch this video carefully to understand what Autoproctor does so that your test can get marked as safe. Autoproctor monitors your camera and mic during the test. When the test loads, grant Autoproctor access to both of them, else you cannot take the test. If Autoproctor cannot detect a face at the beginning of the test, the test will not load. Once your face is detected, it will capture the first photo. Throughout the test, ensure that the camera can see your face. If the camera cannot see your face, Autoproctor will take a photo and store it for later. Autoproctor calls these events violations. Let us look at how you can avoid other violations. Do not take the test in a dark room. There must be enough light in the room. Always ensure that only you are looking at the test and no one else. Your background should not have too many objects or a bright light source. It must be as plain as possible. You must take the test in a quiet environment. If a noise is detected, it will get recorded. During the test, do not switch to a different tab or application. You must always be on the screen where you are taking the test. If you switch to a different screen like Google, this will also be captured. After you finish the test, the test administrator, like your teacher, will get a report of your test performance. Your teacher can then see all the violations that were committed during the test. For example, if you open a different tab, the teacher can see how long you were away from the test. Depending on the number of violations, Autoproctor assigns a trust score to your test attempt. The fewer the violations you commit, the better your trust score. There are other violations that Autoproctor detects as well. It isn't important to know about all of them. Just take the test like you would if someone was around you. Don't do anything that seems suspicious. Always ensure that you are looking directly at the test, that there is no noise around you and that you are not changing the tab or application. Your trust score will then be high. Good luck!